cold winter weather can play havoc with our skin. Never so has anyone waited so long <laughs> for a chocolate which can also play havoc with your skin, let me tell you. So if you've got a little spare time in lockdown, why not use it to reset your skincare routine? Caroline Hirons is here to help. Morning, Caroline. Good morning. I'm gutted. I'm missing everything. <laughs> yeah, no, you are missing out big time here. Sorry. What's your, what's your favourite? Oh, the minty triangle. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think that all of that one. Oh, this one. Is this is this your favourite? Mm. Is this your favourite? You like this one, do you? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I'm glad that everyone can see what it's actually like. I've never seen you do such a thing. That's the meanest thing you've ever done. Oh, it's so good. <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> I love it. Oh, this is my friend. Oh, oh, oh. Sorry. Well, let's hope it gives us spots, eh? <laughs> <laughs> right then, what are we doing? Well, we've got another three and a half ish weeks left in lockdown. Mm -hmm. Why not just use the opportunity, if you don't have to wear makeup, if you're not leaving the house, to just sort of get your routine in order? So. I've gone for a very, very simple, basic routine, but also kind of up the ante a bit in the evenings so that you will, your skin can recover so that when we get into December and it's Christmas time and we're allowed out again, please, it's all good. Yeah, that sounds like a really good idea. So where do we, where do we start then? We're going to start with skin ingredients, Sally Cleanse. Now it looks like this, just give you a traditional holding it up to the camera. Now, there are, I'm going to skip ahead, but come back. There are two cleanses I've given you from Skin Ingredients. Now, this one is the prebiotic cleanse. And the, basically, you can use both AM or PM. However, if you are slightly spotty and you have a bit of maskne, although you would normally say, why don't you use this in the evening? You can use it in the morning. Okay. A little bit of salicylic acid, very gently going to help with the spots that you're going to get from stuffing your face with all that chocolate. Oh, yeah, I'll take that home. Thank you. Um, <laughs> OK, so that's your, that's your cleanser. And your yeah, then vitamin C. So don't be concerned. Don't don't think, oh, I don't need to use that much because I'm not going out the house, etc. You still have a skin. It's still daytime. You still need to protect yourself. Vitamin C from this is Balance Me. Mm, we can have that a, smells there. amazing. It does, doesn't it? So this is vitamin C repair serum. It is really, really um, crucial that we all embrace a good vitamin C. I'll give you a little on it, am I? <laughs> oh, so good. Uh, it's a really nice light serum, uh, suitable for all skin types. Um, no, uh, no contraindications. Every skin can use it. And the key to using a vitamin C is during the day, it'll give you antioxidant protection. But in the evening, especially if you're a bit older, uh, think of C for collagen. So it helps to support your collagen production when those things naturally slow down as we get older. So you can't really go wrong. That's got a lovely smell. Yeah. I like that smell. So yeah. um, vi vitamin C and also vitamin A um, pump as well. So, so the vitamins are good for your skin. Yeah, all of them, to be honest. C, A, E, D. Um, you've seen all of them on the segments we've been doing over the last year and a bit. And there's an A for the evening too coming up. Uh, Moisturiser. This is super facialist, hyaluronic acid, firming. Don't know why I went for firming. Super lift day cream. Looks, there we go. Um, again, this range is really good. This is available now in Sainsbury's. They also do different um, levels of moisture. So if you're someone who's oily combination, you could easily switch this out for one that's just more of a light gel texture. But if you look, it's just a really, really lovely, really lightly absorbs. And also, you can pick it up when you're doing your shopping. Yeah, great. Really good. Now, SPF. I know everyone will be like, well, we're indoors. We're not going anywhere. Why do we need SPF? The general rule of thumb with, with SPF is if you can read without a light, you should be wearing SPF. I, I tell so you what, I'm 40 next year, and I, I'm pretty good with SPF when I'm on holiday all the time. I'm very good. But it is now 100% in my daily routine. I wear it every single day, which is good. Nice work. Um, yeah, and also, you, I personally would do an SPF 30 or a 50. For me, when it comes to taking care of your face, I wouldn't bother going any lower. This is Paulish Choice Essential Glow Moisturiser. This is an SPF 30. Um, I'm all about the glow. I, I know the youngsters still like to sort of have the mattified effect. <laughs> no. I like a glow. I'm a woman of a certain age, Holly. I just want to have, I want to wake up and people go, oh, 
you look fresh. Yeah, or as I like to call it, not, not too shabby. It's about as good as it gets. If you wake up and you go, oh, not too shabby, you're good. <laughs> And so what's good this, about that it, one is it doesn't um, have that kind of white, leave that white on your skin. Sometimes they feel like, I don't know what that is, but you put on a sun yeah, cream. So and it's all... usually a, a zinc, physical, yeah. um, organic, inorganic block, as it's called, is basically usually zinc oxide, titanium dioxide, and they're very thick. And so when you put them on, it's a particular problem for darker skin tones. It can, it can make a darker skin tone look like they've just wiped a white cream all over their face yeah. and it doesn't absorb. So you can, if you look around, the products are much more sophisticated now and you'll easily find something that gives a glow but doesn't make you look like this. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no, fair enough. Next up. Now, switching up to evening, jumping back into cleansers again. Now, this is the prebiotic, pre-probiotic cleanse um, from Skin Ingredients. Now, this one's more hydrating and nourishing. It's... It's basically for my skin type, whereas to give you a classic example, the Sally, this is my daughter, this is me. So she's nearly 19, I am clearly not, I'm 51, and I just need a bit more nourishment, a bit more hydration, a bit more support. And what you're doing with this is making sure that your skin barrier isn't, basically it's a bit like if you think of um, taking your, your coat off. If, you're, if you've taken your coat off and you're kind of a bit more exposed to the elements, it's the same with your skin barrier. And a cleanser like this is really gentle, really supportive, and will do no further harm. And that's kind of what we want to do with skincare. You don't want to use anything really stripping, really drying, because it just it doesn't let things absorb better. Your skin can it leaves your skin prone to being irritated, all that kind of thing, and sensitized in red. So especially while we're already wearing masks, we're already in the elements with now the central heating's on in most houses, I assume. So it's just about keeping things gentle while still letting the skin work for itself. Mm -hmm. And finally, what's this last one here? Now, we've got two left. Don't forget your big box in the middle coming up. OK, so this is Beauty Pie. Now, they are a beauty club and you pay um, a variable monthly fee. You can choose the fee that you pay. And that gives you access to reduced prices of skincare that would normally be on sale for the normal retail amount. Now they started with this super retinol, which is Ceramide Boost Anti-Aging Face Serum. It looks like this. Now, this is a great place to start. So this will be 13 pounds 21 if you're a member and it would be 80 if you were not. This is a great place to start because if you're gonna be inside for another three and a half weeks, sometimes retinol can make you slightly red, a little flaky, or, and you wanna sort of keep that to a minimum if you're out and about and walking around. But if you're at home and you have time to let your skin adjust, you can also step it up a notch. So if you are already using retinols, if you've been using them for a while, outside of obviously a prescription strength, which is a different kettle of fish, Beauty Pie have just brought out the Super Retinol High Dose Intensive Booster Treatment, which looks like this. And I, it's just a great opportunity to give a retinol a go when you're in the safety and luxury of your own home and your skin can take being a bit flaky for a while, a little bit red, because that's what retinol's job is generally to kind of disrupt the skin a little bit. All right. Um, but if you do have a, you know, if you if you are flaking anything like that, if you give it five ten minutes and put a little bit of your moisturiser on, okay. two for one, no need to use everything separately. Put Brilliant. a bit of that on top and do it right down. Thank you, Caroline. Thank very you. much as always. Last one. If you want a complete budget, worth forty pounds, twenty five pounds, Nadine Baggett skincare box from Superdrug. You've got at least, I think, seven items in here and three cloths, and it's a bargain. So if you're looking for presents where you think, oh, she's always talking about things that I can't quite afford or I don't want to spend that much money, 25 quid. Very good. Lovely. Thank you. And Nadine's lovely as well. Yeah, she is. She is. Thank you Thank very you. much. Lovely to see you. Bye. See you soon. Take care. Bye now. Bye.